So this is gonna be my first time using Clip Drop Relight. The only reason why I found this is I just Googled it as like a Relight AI. Cause I was trying to look for an AI program software to relight my image. So I seen it right here. So it's the first one that popped up. All right, so I want to try the Relight. Where is it? All right, right here. All right, so let's go ahead and drag, drop this on there. Image too large for the SD mode. So it wants me to pay, I bet you. Unlock HD mode, go pro. Let me see, what is it doing now? Let me refresh this. All right, let's check the pricing. 15 bucks per month. I don't know what this means. SD 40, 40, 24 hours. Right, I guess let me try just the SD version. All right, so they have some pre-made, preset. So these pre-made one, I'm not really impressed by it. Like I could do this by myself in Photoshop. So. Was this power? Or oh, the brightness, the brightness. And this is the color, color, color. Let's change the color to, um, just leave it kind of like that. This is also another color. So there's three colors. Can I delete this? Oh yeah, I can delete that. So this is the, um, That looks, I see, I see. See, I kind of like that, but I don't know what's that. What, what's that on the hand? Is it coming from this one? Radius. I feel like I could I mean, it's not bad, but it's not blowing me away. Because I feel like I just do this in Photoshop. Oh, so, this, so this is a color then. All right, let's, let's um, bring up the power. So the thing is right there, I don't know what's that. Alright. I mean, I do kind of like it. Like I said, it's not blowing me away. Because you can't even, like, fine-tune that. You would still have to do it in Photoshop. Oh, I see what it's trying to do. Radius. So I guess you have to really tweak it. That looks dope. Oh, I see, so I guess we would just turn this down. Just mess with this. Ah, it's getting somewhere. Change the color. Alright. So there's some things I like about it. But the only thing I don't like is we can't fine tune it. Let me change the color back to something else. Like for this one, I would probably try to clean that up. But then can you, is that a mask? Oh no, that's not a mask. Yeah, there's some things I like, something I don't. Um, 
Is it worth $15 a month? How much image can you produce? How much, how many image can you create? Yeah, the only thing I don't like is I just can't adjust like these things. So I don't know if I will be able to use it. So I don't know if I would use it in, in my project. But I do like some stuff though. Just move it around, you can see it changing. But yeah, I don't like that you can't adjust those things. I would say if you're starting out and you're doing, um, if you're doing uh, mixtape album covers like me, if you're charging on the lower end and clients, if your clients don't mind this, they don't, you know, they don't see a problem with that, that part, then I wouldn't use it because it will speed up your process. But if you're charging more like I am, definitely my clients will want me to fix that. And it's not, there's not even a point for me to use this because I can't adjust nothing. I would just have to do everything myself in uh, Photoshop. So, hope you like this. Kind of like, um, I don't know, is, is it a blind reaction? Is that what they call it? A review? But if you like this type of video, just me just going on here and looking at stuff and trying it out and just giving my thoughts on it. If you want me to do more of it, just uh, let me know in the comments.